Well, you know, many of you saw some strange lights in the sky last night. We got your emails, your phone calls of a lot of lights just moving through the night sky at a steady speed. And they were not UFOs. Mm -hmm. A lot of you thought they might be. I mean, when you see something that unusual and bright, you're like, oh no. Well, it was actually a string of satellites launched by SpaceX as part of its Starlink satellite program. Our Lou Turner explains tonight. It's cool to have a green screen, though. It's about the closest I'll ever get to space. Uh, checking it out. Uh, this is Starlink. About 60 or so satellites orbiting the Earth right now, and they are bright, and you can see them zooming by. We got so many calls about this, thinking, frankly, UFOs? Who, in their right mind, would have the audacity, the know-how, the finances, and the desire to actually create their own constellation in the sky. None other than genius CEO of SpaceX, Elon Musk. These are telecommunications satellites. They're gonna bring broadband internet, high-speed internet uh, around the world, at least that's the plan. And there are gonna be thousands of these up in the sky. They're bright and actually there is a website right now, Find Starlink, you go there, you enter your location, it'll tell you exactly when to look. In fact, tonight you'll be able to see them again. Now here's the issue, they are so bright that actual real astronomers, folks who like to study stars, who look for other stars, are saying these things are too bright. They talked to Elon, Elon agreed. He said eventually they will dim as they get into their appropriate orbit, but he's also going to turn them a bit so they don't reflect the sun. The man can even dim, have a dimmer switch on satellites going around the Earth. Eventually they won't be noticeable, but in the meantime, pretty cool to go out and check out what you can do tonight. An explanation there of what you're seeing in the night sky from space. Lewis, what you doing in space, man? Flight of the Concords reference. If you don't get it, I apologize. I'm Lewis Turner, First Coast News on your side.